So, today in this session, we are going to speak what is meditation, what are its benefits, what are the different techniques of meditation and how we can start doing meditation and what are the requirements to meditate. So, firstly, what is meditation? Meditation is a training of the mind just like fitness is a training of the body. It is the delicate art of doing nothing. Meditation comes from the word meditatum, which in Latin means to ponder or to concentrate. In Sanskrit, meditation is called dhyan, where dhi means dhi means the mind and yan means to let go. Now meditation finds the first meditation you find in the Upanishads and then you find in all the religious texts, whether it is in Buddhism, Sikhism, Jainism, Hinduism, there is a lot of reference to meditation. So, you will find its reference in all the religious text. And what do you exactly do in meditation? You use some technique to be mindful or to focus your mind on an object, thought or activity. Right? You use some technique to be mindful or to focus your mind on some thought, object or activity. And by doing this, you naturally settle into a state where you are physically more stable, you are mentally more clear and you are emotionally more calm. So, basically this is how, you know, there are many ways to meditate, but basically you do mindfulness or you do focus so that you can come to the state where you are more calm. Now the benefits of meditation. See, relaxation and peace is not the goal of meditation. It is a side effect of meditation. Jab aap meditation karte ho, aapko naturally peace milta hai, relaxation milta hai. Right. And the benefits of meditation are manifold. Number one, you get a very calm and composed demeanor. You have less anxiety and less stress. You are able to connect with others and feel part of others. You don't feel alone. With meditation, you are able to take out your inner talents and potential because you become more self-aware. Today, what you do, you go to astrologers and ask, Please Pandit tell me what I should be doing to get success. He will do some mumbo jumbo and tell you one story and you will waste so many years trying to do that. The answer is inside you, it's not in your birth chart. So when you connect with yourself, you will know what makes me feel more relaxed, what makes me feel more joyful and that is what you are supposed to do. With meditation, you are able to connect to that source of power within you because of which you know what is your value in this world. You are able to feel more happy and you are able to feel more love for the world. Your communication improves because of meditation. And the most beautiful part of meditation is you are able to stand apart from the drama of life. If you are a part of the problem, you cannot find a solution. So people who meditate, they are able to find a very good response or a very intelligent solutions to problems. And definitely people who meditate, they attract luck. In Buddhism, meditation benefits are all related to liberation. Because you are able to liberate the mind from attachments, from situations which are actually beyond your control. Either they are external situations or they are internal emotions. 
and this liberated mind you start awakening and you are no longer a victim of needless desires and you know unnecessary you are not a slave to things that you really don't need to experience and you know people who start meditating for the first time they feel so much of joy which they cannot actually express and then what happens people start noticing them because people feel some kind of attraction energy in them so they start attracting more friends more support system 